Hey folks, it's been about a year since I made my first video reviewing the uh, Firebox 8 inch fry pan. So it's about time for a complete review of the Firebox Ultra Cook Kits. Let's get on it. So when I decided to get outdoorsy, I started off my cook set with this right here. A nice one, two ply stainless steel, you know, frying pan, vertical sides, not really ideal for flipping anything, you know, out of the pan. But this is typically what everyone starts off with, stainless steel, right? Then they get extremely frustrated with this and decide, well, you know what, I need something better. And then we all kind of naturally progress to cast iron. This is my wonderful cast iron pan that I've had for years. Still use it on occasions. But man, this thing is heavy. And I did develop a few hot spots. I don't know if you can see it on there, but there was a couple of spots inside there where you know, so much use, it just started to, you know, thin out and get some hot spots, but it still does its job. Natural progression, right? Cast iron. But man, this thing is heavy. Not ideal for any type of mobile camper. So I started scouring the interwebs for a replacement. I hit just about every outdoor website from REI to Alibaba to Amazon, looking, comparing, trying to find videos of the actual product. And you have to do your research because this stuff gets really pricey. Really, it's an investment, right? Anyway, eventually, I pretty much hit a wall. Analysis paralysis, as they would say. Then I just basically lost interest. At some point, I fell down the rabbit hole of bushcraft and fishing videos and ended up watching just about all the firebox videos and decided to take the plunge. So I bought some stuff. And this is one of the first items that I purchased. This wonderful 8 inch ultra cook set. The cook set is nestled in this tough 500 weight abrasion resistant nylon case with this awesome drawstring which locks everything up nice and tight. The complete kit only weighs 19 ounces compared to this guy. 19 ounces is nothing. The small ultra cook kit comes with an 8, an eight inch frying pan with a pan lifter Or you can opt for the 8 inch pinnacle nonstick pan with no lifter since it does have a detachable handle that comes with it. But this is nonstick. It also comes with this deep dish cowboy plate which expands your cooking methods to include baking, roasting, and broiling. This is a genius idea. This one item completely expands this cook set. Both pans are aluminum and anodized. The uh, anodized surface, it's almost ceramic. It's still hard and it accepts seasoning very well. Uh, this is a very poor example of seasoning because I've kind of ruined the seasoning with some acidic cooks. But if you look at this pan, this was the original seasoning that I did when I first got the pan. And as you can tell, compared to the frying pan, it definitely accepts it really well. I'm going to have to re-season this, but that's in the works. 
it heats up evenly and quickly, which makes it extremely forgiving when you accidentally run out of wood while cooking. In my opinion, this is a very, very good or close replacement to a cast iron pan. Both the pan and the cowboy plate feel solid. You can't warp it, you can't bend it. I have no fear packing this into a backpack with other items. The combination of these two simple items, the fry pan and this deep dish cowboy plate, this is the dynamic duo for camp cooking right here. These two simple items, I feel extremely comfortable with making any type of meal. The way they both nestle so cleanly and effortlessly into one another is perfection. Just look at that. No slips, no gaps. It's just a perfect fit into each other, which makes it great for packing and great for cooks. You can even use this as a cover. And look at that seam. No gaps. Perfection. The fry pan is really shaped like a saute pan. So it's curved on the edge, which makes it really easy to slide food out of the pan. Unlike some other pans, which can be really difficult when you have that 90 degree side. It's more flipping the food out of the pan than sliding out. But just the shape of this pan is amazing, which makes it so much easier to use just in general. And you can see right here by the angle this is really a nice saute pan. There have been some questions about the actual diameter of the top of the pan. So I'm going to take this time and do some measurements. So if you put a ruler on this, see if I can get the, uh, the widest part here. I don't know if you can see this or not, but that looks to be about eight inches. Looks to be about eight and five eighths of an inch, from what I can tell. In centimeters. looks to be about 22 centimeters and that's going to be measuring the top of the pan. So there are really only two cons that I have with this cook set. The first one is that the pans that actually accept seasoning which are the Firebox 8-inch fry pan and also the uh, cowboy plate. These are not dishwasher safe. I'm not 100% sure about the non-stick pan, but I'm almost certain that the non-stick pan, more than likely without the handle because the handle is rubberized, would be dishwasher safe. If I find anything to the contrary, I'll do an update on this. The second con is that I have just about outgrown <laughs> this 8-inch kit. It's great for making small meals or meals that contain small items. So 
I've just about outgrown this. I still love it and I still will use it. With that being said, please welcome the large ultra cook kit. This is a 10 inch cook set. which also includes the pan lifter, the deep dish, or you can also opt for the, uh, the shallow cowboy plate, and this beautiful 10 inch aluminum anodized pan. And this is exactly how it looks fresh out of the package. Look how beautiful that is. I will be doing another video seasoning these pans from start to finish. Please stay tuned for that. If you're on the fence about purchasing one of these kit I can tell you, you will not be disappointed. I can attest to the quality and to the performance of these pans. They have just been amazing. And you can probably see that also in the videos. But definitely, pick one up today.